Howdy ho, DP. I'm Nate Lara. And I am still Colleen Murphy. It's Wednesday the 25th. You're in third period, and DP News starts... Now. Seniors, we'd like to once again remind you that Cornerstone Photography is going to be in the cafeteria this Saturday. Why, you may ask? What do seniors need to take their photos for? What does it mean if they don't have their picture? It means you're not going to be in the yearbook, so you must call 805-529-3187 to make your appointment. Also, seniors, if you haven't received your magazine sales packet, you are slacking big time. So be sure to go over to Miss Ree Hage's office as soon as possible to pick it up. Speaking of magazine sales, let's head over to A. Mackie for an update on those sales. Hey guys, I'm back with more magazine information and uh, updated top four classes with Rattel dominating the top four. Rattel sixth period is in first place. Rattel fifth period is in second place. Lewin first period is now in third place. And Rattel first period is now in fourth place. The magazine competition's heating up. If you have door-to-door -door magazines that you have sold, Turn and Day is right here in the PAC tomorrow before school at 8.30 and during lunch. Remember, the top, two, the top classes will receive both Freebirds and a pizza party, so get those magazines sold. Thanks, guys. Thanks for that informative talk, Alexander. Like Alex has been saying, selling magazines is super easy. It takes a minute to send an email with your link to the online page, and just doing that alone has brought in a lot of sales for me. So get out there and sail, Chargers. Remember, seniors, Thursday is yet another day to turn in magazines. I hope that the idea of a pizza party or even a free birds party will really drive you to sell those magazines. If we reach our goal of $40,000, our senior activities will really be events to remember. The Art Club is meeting tomorrow at lunch in Ms. Hemsley's room. They'll be talking about field trips, murals, and all kinds of other activities coming up this year. If you're like me and you have no artistic ability whatsoever, Think about visiting the art club. They'll be talking about various art techniques, artists, and the ways you can improve the art program around school. So you will definitely pick up some great tips to get started. Hey DP, are you ready to get rowdy at tomorrow night's volleyball game? Well, we have some spirited chargers here to tell you more. Oh, go volleyball! Good job, Noah. Whoa. Go Davis. What are you, what are you doing? I'm getting pumped for the volleyball game on Thursday. Um, what? Have you heard of it? Uh, no. It's in our home gym against SB, what? our biggest rival. Wait, it's against SB? In our home gym, girls volleyball, this Thursday at 6 o'clock. So everyone um, better deck out in all of the gold they have and come to the gold mine. It needs to be the biggest cheer section we've ever had. Oh, I'm wearing gold. You're you going to be there? That. I'll right. be there. Get it with your charger cards for free. Will those boys be there? I don't know. Are you guys going to the volleyball game on Thursday? We'll yeah. be there, all right. Yeah, we will. Be there. Volleyball game Thursday. Home gym against SB. I'll see you there. Wear your gold. This Saturday is also Beautify DP at 9. You need to get one of these events in order to qualify for NHS. So get it done now. Sign up in the counseling office today. As you may have noticed from all the posters around school, this week is the campaign week for freshman class elections. Stay tuned to DP News throughout the week to hear more about campaigns and meet your candidates. Do you have a job? Well, if so, and you probably have the wrong expiration date on it, please go to the career office and they will issue a new one with the correct date on it. Occidental College will be in the library during fifth period today, so swing on by to get the deets on an awesome school. Hey guys, who wants to be a part of Katy Perry's Roar Contest? Come to the football field tonight from 6.30 to 9, and be sure to bring yellow, blue, or white t-shirts, and even a swimsuit if you want to get in the pool. Are you a writer? Well, the 10-10-10 student screenwriting competition just may be the thing for you. In order for you to qualify, DP students must submit up to a 10-page sample showing your examples of your writing. It can be fiction, screenplay, or stage play to Mr. Dent in T3. Well, all right, DP, that's all we have for you today. I'm Nate Lara. And I'm Colleen Murphy. We'll see you tomorrow. Stay classy. What up, DP? Seen here with your sports news. Our varsity girls tennis defeated rival Sam Marcus by a whopping 15-3 score. 
Great job, girls. On the links, Girls Golf took control of Channel League and are now 8-0 overall, 3-0 in Channel League, with a close win over San Marcos. It was the first loss of the season for San Marcos. Mika Hendrickson shot a 42 to lead DP. The final score was 231-244. A little too close for Coach Dan Choi, but a win is a win anyways. Keep the winning streak going. Speaking of rivalry games, our girls volleyball team plays a huge game against Santa Barbara tomorrow night in our gym at 6 p.m. This matchup has been a Channel League battle for the past 10 years, and tomorrow night, our girls need your help. 6 p.m. in our gym. I'm seeing with your sports, signing off.